Welcome to Tunnels and Networking. All right, so now let's think about a synopsis of the course. So our goal is for you to be able to build and secure two-point networks that can securely transmit any data between them using tunnels. Okay, so we're going to start off with an overview, and we're going to refresh your mind around the models and use cases for, for tunnels. We're then going to move into network programming, because we're going to use these network programs to test our tunnels later on. So I'm going to use Python for scripting. And so I'll teach you a little bit of Python uh, network programming in our second module. In our third module, we're going to drill into VPNs and we'll uh, set up virtual private networks and then we'll test those networks with our uh, Python scripts. In module four, we're going to look at IP and IP, where essentially we're going to take one IP packet and put it inside of another packet. In module five, we'll move on to GRE, and this stands for generic routing encapsulation. So essentially, we're going to uh, encapsulate or create a tunnel with the GRE protocol. And again, we'll test it with our Python scripts. In module six, we'll look at SIT, and SIT is really designed for IPv6 packets inside other IP packets. And lastly, we're going to think about SSH tunneling. And sometimes that's called port forwarding with SSH. And again, we'll test that with our Python scripts. All right, a little bit of prerequisites here. I expect you to already understand the standard IP protocols, but we'll review some of the models, including OSI, right? But they're going to be review. You should also be familiar with the Linux operating system. All of my configuration examples will use Linux. My hope is you'll then understand from a standard Linux environment how to apply that to proprietary router configurations. And you should also be comfortable with Python scripting. I'm going to use Python scripting to test our tunnels. All right, so our goals are, when you're all done, you should be able to describe the theoretical foundations of how network tunneling works. You should be able to list some tunneling protocols. We're going to go through a lot of that. You should be able to describe use cases for tunneling protocols. And you should also be able to describe misuse cases for tunneling protocols. I want you to be able to develop Python scripts to test the network tunnels. I want you to be able to configure different tunneling protocols in Linux. And lastly, I want you to be able to apply the course competencies to proprietary router configurations. All right, let's dig in.